first day of deer season here, PA, and it's about 10 to 7, legal shooting light, and we're already hearing shots ring off. Uh, I'm sitting in the blind with Mikey. Uh, we got Migs down over the hill, and I think he just cracked, he just cracked one. And we got Mason in front of us about 200 yards. So we got this top pretty much uh, taken care of. Um, I don't have a gun, but Mikey's got a gun. But if we end up, she ends up shooting one, uh, she's going to hand me the gun and we're going to try to pull a double. But it's cold. It's dang cold. I mean, it's the wind, yeah, the wind chill's got to be pretty close to, pretty close to single digits. Ooh, look at that. There we go. It was like nine in St. Mary's. Yeah, super cold. And it's 15 degrees right now with, like I said, 10, 15 mile an hour winds. It's gusty, but it's cold. And uh, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop chirping and get my head in a swivel. And the reason why I'm in a blind right now is because we both agreed not to be in a tree stand because I didn't want to be freezing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, all right, uh, we can shoot a doe. I cannot shoot a buck. Mikey can shoot a buck and a doe. We got multiple tags for the spot, so hopefully we uh, get more than one doe coming up through here. So, all right. Good luck. Thanks. You will. <laughs> Tell you what, if something comes in here, that lighting's gonna be pretty. I can be like Tate. <laughs> Couple more years, I'll have them. <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> Ooh, my glasses are cold now. I don't think I could wear my glasses and shoot a gun. Oh no, I have to look over the top of them. Oh. Like an old man. Like a librarian. A library. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you ain't lying. They stalled down there. Okay. Yeah, she's coming up. You see him? There's a, there's a pile of them. And there's a bunch down there. He's on the front one. I'm just looking. There's like 12. Do you see him? Which one do you want? He's going to be coming up here pretty soon. Stop. She has a tree between me and her. Oh. And the ones behind her started running, so she ran. Yeah. It's tough when you're in those little, all these little trees. Yeah. I said 12 at first, but there was like nine. Yeah. yeah. You know what they're doing? I don't know if they're going to run right around Mason or not. You know, what I'm gonna do now it's it's midday in the morning it was dead there's people shooting all around us uh, Migs ended up getting the doe earlier so he helped me drag it out and now he's up on 
up on watch where Mason was sitting uh, this morning. Mason moved over in the blind with Mikey, so they're buddy hunting there, getting warm. And what I'm doing, I just dropped down and I'm gonna be pushing this section of woods up over the hill. And I brought my gun with me just in case I see a doe and we'll see how this works out. It's just gonna be a quick push and hopefully someone gets some shooting. Cause I know there's a bunch of guys up moving around right now. I mean, really moving. But it's, it's cold, it's, the wind's really ripping and it's, it's 15 degrees out where I'm at now. Oh, someone's walkie talkie in me. Let's see what's going on. Hello? Yeah. Was that you that tried to get a hold of me? No. Okay, did you get a hold of uh, Moose? I did not. He did not respond or he, you just didn't get a hold of him yet? Did you try on your cell phone? Okay, well, ooh, I just walked up on, on a spot where there was a bunch of turkeys, so just keep a heads up, buddy, all right? All right. All right, take care. So, yeah, I'm not even 100 yards into the drive, and I found out where there's a bunch of turkeys running around. Look at all this. This is all sorts of scratched up. Too bad it's not turkey season. They'd be in trouble by somebody. I already got mine. So, all right, I'm gonna push to do this little push for these guys and hopefully someone gets some shooting. Or maybe I might get some shooting. I don't know if I'm going to get it on film. I don't have my tripod, but hey, whatever. All right, catch you on later. See, a lot of times when you do these one-man drives, you want to, you just don't want to walk in a straight line. You want to look at the, the terrain. You want to find out where the ridges are at, because more likely they're going to curve those ridges. They're going to hook and just follow them. Yeah, sometimes you get some that blow up over the top, but you want to follow the ridges, cross back and forth and zigzag. And when you set your, your spotters up or your shooters you have them on those like little barrier escapes where the deer like to funnel through that's where Miggs is at and Mason and Mike are up on top on this flat so there's just, there's just maybe between where they're at and the next ridge might be 20 feet but that 20 feet is a lot to an animal for cover because they'll just feel safe and they just cover the terrain so just a little advice when you guys are driving Especially one man drives. You just take your time. Don't make a lot of noise. Don't get the deer scurried up. And these deer will actually know you're coming and they might scatter, but they won't be blown out of there running 500 miles an hour so the shooters can't shoot and make an ethical shot. So just take your time, tiptoe through the woods and mill around and cross back and forth to the area where you want to go. Sometimes you catch a deer looking at you. Sometimes those deer will just walk on by. All right, let's get going. Oh, there's a bunch of deer tracks right here. Oh, cow. Oh, these are definitely today. I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna go do some sneaking up through there, see if I can't catch these ones. It looks like they're walking, they're not running. Oh yeah, these are pretty old. I seen a couple chunks of ice on it. But whatever. It's still, it's like, I guess I just want to say like maybe second rut, whatever, but there are still some bucks that are looking for some does. So if I see a buck, there's probably a doe near it. I just check my map app and I'm going to the right too far. I don't want to go too far right and have these deer, nope, piece of bark, <laughs> and have these deer uh, skirt around everybody. So I'm just going to take my time and fiddle faddle through here. This 
sec. I just saw a body, just saw a body sprinting up through the, the trees that way. And it's headed up towards those guys, so. But I just kicked that deer. This could be deer, but it's underneath a big old white oak. Some coyote tracks. Yeah, there's some, I definitely kicked these deer out. There's some tracks going up that way, cool. Ooh, big buck tracks. Big buck tracks, look at this. Big buck tracks. Bank and left, so it's going up towards Migs. This is where those deer went through here. gray squirrel but yeah the whole, yeah there's definitely a buck in this one I just heard shots up over the hill it's muffled down where I'm at it could be them and I don't know I'm not sure I'm just gonna tiptoe and take my time Arms. <laughs> Boy, this is a nice opening in here. Oh, you ain't kidding, this is nice. Yeah, these deer are running right up to them. Sorry about the wind, I didn't get a windsock yet, but I see Mix right up here with his hands in his pocket. I'm guessing it's him. Yeah, the shot of a buck. Big buck? Yeah. Huh? Big buck, where at? Was it walking or running? They were walking. They were? Yeah. How much was There was four does and I think two bucks. Really? Down here. They walked right up this way. And I think I took my first shot, I think I took right over here. Yeah. And then the second shot I took over there. And no, I hit him over there. Did you walk over there? Not yet. Okay. Me yeah, good. Was it like far? But you think he, he, he did drop or what'd he do? He, I know when I hit him the second time, he fell over there. And then I think he got up again. Okay. I'm going to go get Mason and Mikey. But you don't know if he got back up and ran the second time? The second time, I, he, I think he got back up and ran again. Okay, but you think you hit him twice? Okay. I'm going to go back and get get those guys, pack up that stuff. Uh, Mason can't shoot because he put mud in his barrel. It happens. So he's going to be, he's going to grab the camera. So you wait here, okay? Good job, dude. Was it like, how big? When I saw, I didn't see it at first. It was like, there's got to be a buck on Really? It looked like it. It, it. If it's not like too many points, it's definitely very wide. Cool. Because I, I came across some big buck tracks down there early, and I'm like, they're walking right up, and I heard you shot, heard you shoot. So, all right, I'm going to go back there. We'll come back here. Good job, dude. Well, you're having a heck of a day. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Big said he shot a big buck. And they were walking, so that's good. He's, he's a dandy shot. 
but he didn't see it after he shot the second time or whatever. He was, evidently, you know what happened. I'm not going to explain it. I can't even talk straight right now. So I'm going to go up and get Mason, Mikey, pack up everything, or they can just sit there until we're done. But that's, that's going to be up to them. So we'll see. We'll see what we come up with. Oh, that's so cool. Rifle season PA finally got some snow. He didn't walk up there. He said he hit it twice. He says it nice. I thought that was Migs. Yeah. I thought that was you. No. No, oh. he shot twice. Yeah. Yeah, Migs shot, Migs shot a buck. Good. He, he said two buck came up. And he, I think he said four doe walking right up in front of him. No way. Yeah. He was close. No, he's over there. Oh, it sounds like he was right down here. Yeah, he was aiming that way. Oh. So, yeah. Good for him. Um, Mason, I'm going to have you come out here and film this. Okay, because you can't, I'm sorry, you can't shoot. I'm sorry. But I want to get the gun. I can't shoot. Oh, I don't know. Because if, if that buck's wounded, I can't shoot it. Because I don't have a buck tag. Oh, yeah. We'll figure it out. You want to stay here and hunt? Because there's an unbelievable amount of traction. Guys are starting to push on the other hill. Okay. You want me to? Yeah, just go ahead and just sit here. Okay. Come on, buddy. I'm waiting for Mason to get out of the blind. Mikey's just going to sit here and hunt, so... We're gonna see if we can't find him, make his buck. Cool. That's awesome. You ready, dude? So you ready? Yeah. Sorry about your gun. Sorry. Sorry. That's, that's tough. It mm -hmm. happens. Yeah. It does happen. So that's why you just gotta watch your muscles out of it. Um, I'm gonna have you carry my gun until we get the mix. Okay. Okay. So like like I said, if I can't, I, if I see it, I can't shoot it. I don't have a tag. Mm -hmm. But you can. So I'm figuring if you can at least knock it down, it's going to be his deer regardless. Oh, 100%. Oh, he you know didn't what I mean? see where it went? Huh? Did he he not... said he hit it the first time, and then it ran, and he shot and it dropped. Then he got back up. He didn't. He doesn't know if it died or what it was. He didn't even go over and look for it. Okay. Yeah, so. Cool. Good you, for him. You just stay in your oven over there. Oh, I stepped on my Christmas cake. Oh, that's horrible. Okay, we're going to go my bag. Let's Betty Crocker deal with it. Come on, That's probably smart. I'm glad you thought of it. Thank you. Yep. Oh yeah, you're warm. Good, I'm steamy. You're welcome. Thank you. Don't melt your cheese. Oh, crap. All right, we're out of here. What's that? Did you say how many points it was? No, he said it was big. Well, that's uh, Yep. I, I don't, I don't even care. I don't think he cares about like a little spike. But he goes, it was like a week up to his ears. Yeah. He said they were just walking. So. All right. Well, that's cool. Yeah, get out ahead of me for me. Thank you. Smart idea. Did you guys see any other deer? Uh, I think Mikey saw one. Was it running? I think so. It was like way too late behind it. Behind us. That's all right. He sees it, he's gonna knock it down. And you know, like I said, it's still your deer. But like I said, I can't shoot it because I don't have a tag. All right. Okay, what we're doing now, we're just gonna go try and see if we can find out where. Oh, there's hair right here, Mix. There's hair right here. That's chest hair. See the 
running track. You say you ran this way? Took an angle that way. That's what it looked like. And then I saw him. He stopped. So I shot him again. Yeah. You always shoot until they drop. Okay. You got hair here. That's a That's like 50 yards. And you said there was four, five. Four, four dough and a buck. Okay. Yeah. Just keep your head in the school just in case something else might come around. Well, we got hair. We got tracks. We just got to find out where blood or not. And maybe lead up to where we possibly hit it again. So. Alright. I'll let you know once we see blood. Sometimes what they do when they go, they go through some thick stuff and they get in, in an opening, they might bed at the edge of the opening or just on the other side of the opening so they can see better. So we're really going to have to go slow and pay attention. Okay? I thought I saw a deer over there. You got blood. Said it, it said drops, so I could be wrong. But yeah, you can see how there's blood all through there. But there's a lot more blood there, so. I mean, you, I mean, you to look at the, all the blood slowly. You, I need you to look ahead. Yep. Okay? Because that way you're over him. You're over him and you can point him. Okay, but if you see him, just stop. Okay. Make sure you're stopping. And, and like straight ahead at 12 o'clock. Yeah. You know, know what we mean, Mix? Okay, so, Nick, Nick, take your time. There's no rush. I mean, because if he's still, if he's still down, he's bedded right now. I guarantee you that. He's going to have his head up. Look for ears. Look for rack. Look for black round eyes and white patch. Okay. If you see him looking at you, don't worry about the body. Shoot him right. Aim right for the eye. Okay, you're a good shot. I think that's a rock at Sucker's Air Boy. He's dead. He's dead right over here. Where? 50 yards in front of you. He's a tanker. You see the big, big old body right there. We'll, we'll build it. Oh, Alright. Good job, dude. Holy cow. That's a good buck. That's a good buck. Let's go. Holy crap. Oh my god. Go slow. Dude, that's a nice buck. Remember, go slow and just take your time. Because sometimes he could be just like laying there. You know what I mean? Sometimes you can just lay there. Find an opening. Put an opening in between you. I think that deer's out for the count though, dude. Yeah, Michael! Get your 
it down off your shoulder. <laughs> He's done, dude. Go on up. Make sure you tap them first. Holy crap, Mike. Good job, dude. <laughs> Watch your gun. Here, give me your gun. Give me your gun. Okay, unload it. Mason, unload your gun. Good, grab a hold of it. I don't have it. Okay. Holy crap. Nice buck, dude. It's going to be a rough one to cut. Huh? I think it's going to be a rough one to cut. That's all right. You got practice this morning. That's a damn. Put your gun over here. Go ahead, walk out and get behind your deer, dude. Not bad of a shot. Not bad of a shot. Second shot, you shot the rump. Yeah. That's alright. Dude, I know sooner started that drive, I heard boom. I'm like, what? Boom! I'm like, oh, that's somebody up here. Dude, that's a dandy buck, Michael. Finally. What's that? Finally. Yeah, that's a nice buck. Good for you. Good. Good for you. That's a nice six point. Yeah. That's a big that's six. Wide. That was a line when I told you. Yeah, he's pretty wide. Holy cow, bud. Dude, you're done. How about being tagged out the first day, huh? Yeah. Well, you got a doe in early rifle season. And you killed a doe here, took it down to the truck. Nice buck, dude. That's a heck of a first day. <laughs> Good job. I stuck a butt in my hands from the first deer. What's up? I stuck a butt in my hands from the first deer. <laughs> yeah, that is, that is a dandy, dandy buck. What a day. Good for you, bud. What a day. <laughs> Jesus. Dude, that's a champ. That's a champ buck. First buck ever. That's your first one. That's my first one. <laughs> <laughs> Michael bringing home the bacon. Oh yeah. Holy crap, man. Mike and I both thought you shot. Me? Yeah. I don't know. Nope. Like I wasn't 100 yards into the drive. Yeah. yeah Dandy buck, Mike. Hey, you hit me up on the walk and talk. You're like, I'm gonna start the drive. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, I wanted to make sure I was in inside the wood line first before I radioed him. Jeez. I wonder if he saw me walking up. Maybe. They were just walking? Oh, yeah. They were kind of just like, there's like a crew. A crew of them? Uh, like a crew, but yeah. Oh, they were all like just trotting, like not trotting, but just moving along. <laughs> yeah, because it was probably dang near half a mile when I started. There's definitely four down with them for sure. That's but great, dude. Because I was in the same spot that we sat last year. Yeah. That's where I sat. Dude, that is a stellar, stellar buck. Let me get on that. Look at that thing. Giant six point. Holy crap. <laughs> dude, this is look good for you. Hey, nice spot. Thank you. And like I said, yeah, I remember I said when they're hit, sometimes it goes through a clearing and they bed up either on a ridge because there's a ridge 
right here, like a little bit of a downgrade. And then he could probably see us coming through that opening if he was alive. But that's what you got to look for. Good tag team, bud. Yeah. Mason? Yeah, boy. Cool. All right. Nice job. How about that? I don't, you don't need to be in there. You can stand there. You just, you just stay there, tall man. I don't need your sass. I'll go find Michael. No, get over here. You're good. <laughs> no, but anyways, that's that's how we end this day. Two down. It's not even noon. I like it. I don't think so. Yeah. Any to say, Michael? Um, what a day. What a day. What a day. I'll say it for you. Holy mashed potatoes. <laughs> Work paint. Work paint. Hmm. Do this. Where do you want me to go from? You know where there's blood. Oh boy. Yep. Mix first buck, baby. Put your hat up. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> that stinks. That's nasty blood too. Oh, rooming. Oh, it looks cute. It's like Raggedy Ann and Andy. Ha, ha, ha.